All right, all right, all right, party people. This is your man Griff. Doing a quick video on printing issues. Um, Solidify and 5280 signings sent out emails about the printing issues. I guess they talked to Adobe or somebody told them or whatever. So um, here's what's going on. All right. So Solidify sent out this email saying, you know, Solidify has recently, was recently made aware of an issue with Adobe that some of our notaries are experiencing as a part of an update Adobe enhanced security feature causing an issue for some users that are attempting to print mixed page sizes, letter and legal. This feature prevents the package from printing more than one page size. Thank you to the notaries that reached out to solidify and shared the below solution that's resolved the issues for several notaries. So this is the solution. You launch Acrobat, you click edit from the menu bar, preferences, click on security, enhance, uncheck that feature there, um, enhance, enable, protect, enable protected mode at startup preview, click yes on the pop-up, then click okay, close out and relaunch Acrobat. So what they're talking about, let me switch over to the other screen. Do, 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 do. So let me close that because I already had that up. So what they're saying is click on edit when Adobe Acrobat is open, preferences. <coughs> and in this case, most of the time, um, it'll be set to page display or one of these up here. And then you just go down here to security enhance and then you uncheck that. Now for me, mine was already unchecked because a couple of days ago, I wasn't able to print either the mixed pages. And one set of documents, it was an emergency. Oh man, I'm tired. Yeah, it was an emergency and I had to just print everything on legal just to get it over with because I had never had this problem before. So I uninstalled Acrobat and I reinstalled it. Um, because I'm, I'm paying for it, the um, creator suites. And once I reinstalled it, everything was fine. So I believe when I reinstalled it, it was reinstalled with this here unchecked. And then I was able to do what I needed to do. Um, now, one of the other things that I've um, discovered is that some people, even though they may have uninstalled and reinstalled, they are still having a problem. And then it seems like if they have the paid version of Adobe, they're good. The free version of Adobe is still giving, is giving people some problem. So you may have to pay, do the paid version. If you can get it to work with the free version, excellent. But if you are still having a problem and you follow this, these steps, then you may need to just go ahead on and, um, pay for Adobe Acrobat um, at whatever price they charge. I don't even, I think it's 14 or 15 bucks a month. So you may have to do that um, and then go from there, okay? So you give that a try, but um, that's it. Everything else is smooth and sweet. So I appreciate all of y'all party people. Um, y'all are wonderful, y'all are great. Keep up the good work keep getting those signings and everything else is going to fall in line. All right. Talk to y'all later. Peace.